It's our new friend, uh, Shinya Satake. I apologize if I'm mispronouncing that, but um, our friend challenged us to a game, I think of 10 minute on Shogi Wars. So, good luck. I play Gota this game. All right, let me turn my volume down slightly so we don't get an echo. Uh, okay. Let's play the Rook over here just for fun. So yeah, our, uh, they are rated one Don. I am one Q. But I've not played on this website for some number of months, so maybe I have a chance. Oh my. Well. <laughs> I tempt fate. Ah, oh, this is a bad idea. But it looks fun. <clears throat> I couldn't help myself. Yeah, so I have to take uh, one of two ways here. Let's try this. If I do rook takes, then I'm losing a knight. So this way, I'm only giving an exchange. And we'll see how it goes. Let's see. Um, this looks kind of fun. So, I have another bishop, and I have a pawn, and maybe I can use my other pieces somehow before I get checkmated, if I'm lucky. Shogi Wars has given me some interesting habits, so I try not to play too much of it, but boy is it addicting. So my thought right now is I'm going to wait on attacking this. Um, if I piled another piece attacking this, uh, they would bring up the silver and put the king on 3-1. Uh, instead, I'm going to wait for the king to move and then target this, and that'll make their shape of the castle awkward. So what's going to happen is they're not going to move the king, and since they're not moving the king, it's going to stay in the center. That's the plan. Also, the other plan is to push this and take the rook. And why should I not do that plan? It looks too good. What's wrong with it? I don't know. Interesting. So... Oh, I've had a similar position before. Um...
All right. I want to have some fun. We're going to have some fun. Implying that this position is not already fun. <laughs> oh my. All right, all right. So the only thing that can make this even more fun is if I bring the knight up right now while everything else is going on. Uh, I could get one more tempo. It seems unwise, but, you know, when has that stopped me? Hmm. Yeah, I need to do this. My soul demands it, so... We'll see just how bad it is in a moment, in a moment or a minute. Um, it dawns on me after I've played. Well, no, hang on. This is not hanging the token. I keep forgetting I have that attack. All right, I am in check. I need to do something about that. I have done something about that. So now I've got a rook. Um. My big idea was knight takes pawn here. Which looked so fun. Nanafun. Do I take the rook or do I take the pawn? Which one goes first? I mean, I could take the knight also. This rook is not doing much here, but it can activate itself really quickly. My bishop here is not doing much. I could drop a rook just to make things more complicated. But the golds defend each other, so it's not that decisive. Um, yeah, we're going to do this because it looks fun. Playing the fun move is what's motivating my play today. Um, all right, as much fun as we can have. This bishop's trapped. Let's exchange it. And let's get our bishop out of harm's way. Also prepare to take the lance and to drop a rook back here. Maybe I've got a knight drop that does something. Nah, probably not. My king is extremely exposed, but that's fun. <laughs> if I give them a rook, I'm screwed. But otherwise, my king has plenty of places to run to. On the Shogi Harbor Discord, um, I've given myself the nickname of King Runner. Because, boy, my king just enjoys wandering the board a bit. Um, all right. That attempts to force... My horse to stay here um also makes a good threat against my castle uh yeah no that's actually a pretty serious threat hmm what to do Gofun.
I think I've made this position too complicated for myself. Hmm. How to approach? Okay, this lance is actually very menacing. We're just gonna remove it. That looks crazy, but, you know, I have my reasons. We have one pawn in hand. Um... This looks fun. Double check my overlay. Looks good. All right. Oh yeah, this fork. All right. Well, we can cut off one prong of that fork right here. Huh. Interesting. All right, we're just going to play the fun move. That's been my MO so far. There's no reason to change it. So the observation here is that if the king doesn't have a lot of places to run to, that this attack could be pretty... could be... it could have consequences. Um... Hmm... Yeah, I'm thinking, I'm thinking. Yeah, why not? Hang everything.
I'm sure there's a reason why not, but, you know, I just don't see it. That might be the reason. That looks like an interesting reason. Uh, I didn't see that move. <sighs> well, what now? Maybe this? Hmm. This king is not easy to surround. That's clever. Um, well, I have pawns, so I should use pawns to attack. I don't know. I do not know.
Oh. I remember how pieces move. Maybe. Alright, that's unfortunately how Shogi Wars goes. I hung a rook or a dragon there at the end. Uh yeah, that was exciting. <laughs> My mistake. I did not intentionally hang the dragon. Yeah, that was an exciting game. Um, I think these games, Between Friends, are uh, practice games, so they don't count against your rating, but they might count against your... <laughs> oh, thank you. <laughs> thank you. Yeah. Yeah, when sometimes you catch me when I have some energy and when I just want to have fun. I will play some exciting moves. Uh, that's usually how things go. I just play like whatever looks like the most interesting thing. Uh, so yeah, I I mean, the it was a very exciting game toward the very end here. I played some silly things like uh, this here. Uh, this knight can just take the dragon. I didn't see that. That's my mistake. Um, and then afterward, I just panicked in time pressure. No, that's it's fine. This is a really exciting game. Um, the the fact that we're playing on Shogi Wars causes so players to make mistakes. It's just how the website works. Uh, it's I don't know. It's silly but uh, fun. Um, yeah, so that was an uh, exciting game. Um, oh, I honestly don't know. Like, this is really confusing to me. Um, we both play very aggressively, so, uh, yeah, this is fun. This is a good attack. I have a good attack. These things are really challenging to understand, especially in such a fast game. And that's okay. This is a good attack because it approaches my king, it attacks my gold, and um, I got carried away here. Uh, this, so my gold is hanging, my pawn is hanging, my king is exposed, my lance is hanging, all my rooks are just floating. It's I could not have made things more confusing for both of us, so that was pretty exciting. Hope the viewers enjoyed that too.